So I guess it's that time. How's it going, everybody? My name is Daniel. And welcome back to Stone Hearth. A mysterious message just appeared. You will want to finish the wolves before they finish you. Strike first. So the one that watches you is giving me a little bit of info. Um, don't know if that's a good guy or bad guy, but we're gonna go have a war again and make sure we take down this bandit camp. There is a strong unit in there. If you look at him, he looks pretty spoopy. Um, feeling warm? Of course you're feeling warm. Let's uh, go ahead and send our army. They should be pretty good at getting here. They should be able to cross this bridge, I hope. And not have to take the long way around. Um, yep, they're right here, which is perfect. The only downfall is there's... There we go. I say the only downfall is there's only two of them. And our cleric's kind of a little ways away. But, welcome back to Stone Archive. Last episode, we went ahead and fought off that little goblin king, and we managed to actually defeat him, which is sweet. Now, what we have to do is go ahead and take out this little camp, which somebody gave us a little bit of info for. Pretty! Where are you at? My cat's scratching my chair. Like, not my chair, but like, scratching a little part of our little comfy chair we have over there. She's not supposed to do. She knows it. So, unless she might have... Here, give me a second. I think maybe she might have fallen behind the couch. Why is it every time I want to record something happens? My cat literally got stuck behind our little sofa chair there. Like, <laughs> what a freaking weirdo. God damn it, princess, what are you doing? Um, so I have a nice little comfy chair in the corner of my bed area. That should be free now, so we should hopefully be safe. Yep, yep, ow! Okay, thank you very much for not killing me. But every time I go to record, this happens. Something always happens. And this time it was my little kitty. She she fell behind her comfy couch and managed to get stuck and so she knows not to scratch stuff so that's why i was like hmm that's weird i better go check on her and i did and what is it she's freaking stuck what a little weirdo um but we did just get a male finally now he kind of i think he has black hair so i'm gonna go ahead and name this person marcus a person requested me naming um oh look at the wolves look at them go a person requested me naming a male with black hair Marcus. So we're gonna go ahead and name this guy Marcus. Marcus M, I'm gonna name him. Because he said you can name it Marcus or Mary. He just wants somebody with black hair. So there we go. Marcus M, that is a new guy, part of our squad. The reason I put the M is because Mary. Not the best unit, uh, but you know what? We're gonna have some use for you. That's for dang sure. So I'm gonna go ahead and scratch that off our list. Now, next up, we wanna try and get two male fighters. So we want a warrior and we wanna name him JK and we want an archer named Patrick. So those are gonna be our next things going on here. Our people are literally chatting underwater. What the hell is going on over here? Guys, don't drown yourself, please. I really wanna like just finish our builds and everything, but things keep happening to the part where I can't just let it go and let everything build up. Um, because I don't want you guys to miss anything. Let's see if we can get another trader coming here. Perfect. And he gives us some good stuff as well, so that's even better. Now, again, I don't know if we're using these for anything, so we're not going to touch them. These we were just building to pretty much sell. The fish we don't need. Because once we get a cook, we will need them. But in order to get that, we need to start mining and all that stuff again. Which won't happen for a little while. We have a lot of beds. Invaders approach. Where at? Oh, oh wow, we actually got a pretty decent fight about to go down. That's not good. Our cleric is good and healing, thank gosh for her. But so bad. Luckily our other fighter just got here to help out. That guy's going down pretty hard, he's backing up. He seems to be healed, he'll be good. I'm trying to get a good angle on this fight for you guys, but look at that, two big wooden tree ends, I think they're called. Giant endling, there we go. And then the little ones, the little ones are fine, like, but the big one, damn. Gold ingot for 75, we'll sell that while the fight goes down. I don't think we really need to sell much. Let's sell this stuff here. Well, let's go ahead and uh, buy some more of these things. It's better just to get everything now. We don't really need most things, so. Trader returns, thank you very much. They spent a the whole day swimming. Wow, good job. 
But there we go, that was that little army of monsters completed, thank gosh. Definitely getting a little bit harder as you guys can tell. I really want them to finish this bridge once they finish it or people want it to keep swimming. Damn. That's insane. They're slowly building up over here too, which is it's coming together. Our little scaffolding is coming together so they're going to have easier access to the roof. Whereas I want to have archers up top and just chilling. I think that'd be a pretty cool spot to kind of like rain down damage. Um, wow, that was definitely not something I was ready for. What did she grab? She grabbed a new helmet or armor, I hope. As long as they're, as long as they're equipped in and, you know, getting better what they have. Happy. There's level 2 mason, which is exactly what we needed to be able to make the craft spoon. So thank freaking god for that. Um, we're, want, we're gonna want to maintain at least two of these. We're gonna need a lot more stone, which sucks, but you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. We're gonna need to maintain at least two of these as well. Once they get that spoon going on, we're gonna be able to get her cook. So let's watch her real quick. She looks super cute. Look how cute she looks. Well, Pigtails or ponytail, whatever. Pigtails, I think that's what that's called. For hair. Come on, little girl. Let's do it. Sanini? Sanini Paps. If anybody wants to be this character, just let me know. I'll let you. Remember, if you guys, you know, if you want to be a part of this, just let me know. Just tell me what character you want to be, and I will gladly change the name of that person for you guys. Now. You're who we want our farmer to be. You are the person we're gonna upgrade to our one thing. You are now our cook. Welcome to the cooking. Welcome to the cooking course. Voila. Something happened. The swimmer. Dude, stop swimming. Let's build the floor. Oh, I think they are. Yeah, they are swimming. Okay, I guys shouldn't have to build it. You guys shouldn't have to do that shit anyway. Nice. Craft that, craft that. Oh, finally we're gonna have some cooked food. We're gonna just maintain 15 of these. We're gonna, I, I don't even know if we can maintain it, but we're gonna try and just cook five of those. Pretty much anything on here, I'm just gonna, wow. Do we really not have that many veg? What the hell's going on with our farmers? You got so much of it, what are you talking about? Maintain five of those. Maintain five of those. Pretty much our cook is always gonna try and like keep us topped off on food, which is gonna be really good. Everything's just gonna be maintained quite a bit of. The bug meat is probably the one that we're gonna have the most of because we'll literally just have so much of it going on. Refugees, can you hear the howling? The goblins in the woods? Oh God, are you kidding me? What? Fudge me. More. This game, man, it's getting so much harder. Definitely gotta pay more attention now, which sucks, but you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. Four decorative vases for 16 pieces of charcoal. Do we even, if we have that, then sure. If not, then no. Oops, a coal piece of charcoal. Sorry, mate, can't do that. We literally don't have like any of it. How close are we to this? Oh, we need to make two more gold via trade and have 500 on hand. God, I need her to catch up. She's so slow. Alright, this is getting uh, a little bit heavy. I'm not going to lie. The game's getting definitely a little bit harder. Um, I want to go ahead and put down our cook stuff. Doesn't seem like she's really made anything yet. Probably because we need to mine down in this little area down here. Which I don't mind doing. I don't mind doing. Oh, I'm so funny. I didn't realize I said that. Let's go ahead and just do this. Little just mine areas just to kind of find, try to find some ore. That's all this is. There we go. Now I need to go up really quickly and watch this battle. Make sure everything goes according to plan and none of our people die. We'll slowly get there. We'll slowly get there. They have been swarmed by bees 15 times! Wow. That has really got an issue. Hip yip ow! There we go, good job. Where was that? Over here? 
Nice, it was. Oh, we're gonna get some good gear. Wow, that's awesome. We got a little bronze helmet there. Sweet, we got some gold. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I done do. Alright, just make sure we loot up everything. Let's look around the island now to make sure nothing's kinda off in the horizons that we kinda need to mess up. Highly doubt anything's gonna be all the way out here. If anything, stuff will be there. I really want our people to go loot and pick up all of our stuff. So far, it seems okay. Not really seeing any more goblin camps. Every goblin camp we see, we're just taking it out like right away. As long as it's on our base floor level. If it's all, if it's upper level, well, we can't really. I don't really want to get access to it. There is gold ore right there, though. That, that'd be sick to get access to. But if we go up there, it's gonna be able to spawn monsters up there, and therefore more monsters are gonna be able to come and get us. So we think we gotta take our time. Did they finish the? They did. Wow. This is almost complete. That's amazing. Wow, good for them. So this is gold here. Oh no, we are technically picked that up, I guess. There might be stuff from the hunters when they hit R, and then they all panic. How's our food situation looking? Very good. Our net worth is not the best. Are we almost done with this? What do we need? Are you stuck? Oh, you're a herbalist. You're just doing nothing. Okay. Can we possibly make you do something? What's something you could do? Equal to five. We don't. We can make more. Why the hell not? We have so many. Go make twenty-five potions, my girl. Hey, something got completed. The bridge got completed finally. I've been working so hard to get this dang bridge completed so they have access across the water. I think it looks really nice. It's quite long. Um, having more breathing supports kind of going here, here, and like here would probably make the bridge look more realistic, but I think it looks pretty cool. What happened over here? <gasps> Did a baby fish be born? Aw, it's so cute. Algae. I wonder if I can just keep harvesting this. Like it seems to grow back really quickly. Why not? There's some stuff here. Is that like blue? No, that's our stuff. I guess they just put it there. It's a weird spot. Do all of our people have armor now? Yep. Looks like it. Our she. I don't know if she can wear armor, and I don't know if the archer gets any upgrades. If they did, that'd be cool. Let's go ahead and call in a trader. Forager, don't really need any of that stuff, but we're gonna try and figure out what we can sell. We really need to look more and see what the hell I can get rid of. Get rid of all those. I wanna, once this is, once everything, once that's built and once the wall's built, then I can kind of look into here and sell specific things. Until then, I can't really get rid of most stuff. Just because I don't know what we need and don't know what we uh, can part with. We did get our cook's thing now, so that's good to put down. So let's try to find it. What is that? Iron floor candle holder. That looks pretty dope. Don't know where I'll put that, but that definitely looks cool. Now our eating room's in here. I would have loved to have a little cooking room. So maybe we can go ahead and build like an overhang. So let's go into the building mode. Just go in here. Pretty sure it's this dark wood that I used last time. Now, having that window there is going to be weird, but... Hmm. You know what? We'll do it back here, then. Let's have her little... Her little cooking home going to be over here. Let's go ahead and... It doesn't have to be too big, because it's she's literally just a small little woman, so... It can literally just be like this. Little tiny cooking area. That's all she needs. She doesn't need it to be fancy. But this is how I was building last time. And I was like, oh, I did such an amazing job, I was so proud of it, and then it really, like, it hated me. It didn't, the game didn't like what I was doing. But it took me so long to build like this, like, you don't, you guys don't even know. It was a ridiculous amount of time. And in the end, I had to delete it. I literally spent, like, two hours building a really badass home, and that, I had to delete it at the end. I was so sad. I couldn't believe it. Oh, shit. Oh god, this is gonna be horrible. Let's 
No, please fight with the village. Please fight with the village! Okay, you know what? I believe in you guys. We have a cleric. And we have an archer, we have a cleric. Oh my god, a feral bear. I'm just gonna build those, not, not a custom home for her. I need to figure out how to like properly build custom homes before I do any of that stuff. Holy Lanta, a giant ass bear just came rolling up in the crib. Down it goes. Yes. Woo! A slashing strike that it deals up to four enemies around it. Deals damage up to four enemies around it. Hell yeah. Beth? Yes, achieve the title. Nice. Alright, let's go back to what I was doing. Let's just. Let's just delete this, like... I don't know how to... Like, how do you... Well, figuring it out. What did I just do? Oh shit, what did I just do? I don't know. I'm deleting it. Yes. Can you hear the howling of the god? Oh my god, not again. Hello? We literally non-stop combat this game. What the hell is going on? I respect it and love it because our people are going to get much stronger. It's just, oof, this, this is hard. If I can get a blacksmith, I'm going to be a happy camper. That's all I'm saying. Now, put your little table here. Can you make me a blacksmith? You can. You level 3 mason. We need stone. Yeah. That's pretty much done. We just need a trainer to sell stuff here. They defeat. They defended the town against 50 enemies. Good job. Good job. All right. Bronze mace killed an enemy leader. So now it is called Bronze Mace Cleaner. Nice. Good name. Good name. The protectors defended the town. Nice. Go ahead and make sure we loot up everything again. That way our people, you know, can take advantage of everything that we get, so. There we go. Set the wolves free, please, before they come out and just start eating our ass. We really don't need that. Thank you guys, what do we get from here? Not much, but you know what we take, what we get. What we get wasn't much. There we go. Yippee yow. I'm gonna lie, that's actually pretty easy. Like, clerics are busted, man. The healing, the continuous healing that we just get for free, that's awesome. Look at them taking our, our trail, like, hell yeah, good job, you. Oh, uh, I think we ran out of stone. Yeah, I, I don't think, I guarantee, no, we ran out of stone. Let's go back down here and uh, check out how the mine shaft is going. No one's really doing anything. Okay, good to know. Let's try to just constantly make a little mining area that way if we find any ore we can go ahead and just use it literally just make little rooms and random areas there we go hopefully we find some stone i don't want to have to go upwards because i know if we go upwards we can get it just from up here but i feel we, we could definitely find some underground it's just it might be a little bit hard, I hope not. But guys, I think that's probably enough for this episode. It's already been quite long. Our town's coming together. Like, everything's pretty much full built. We just need to build this little home here. Our bridge finally got completed. Our town's coming together quite nicely. Um, if we check out on our food, we have a lot of food. We just need our net worth to go up in value. I can go ahead and click on this building now and hit resume. That way they continue building that. Our little area over here has, I think, run out of stone. How much stone do we need? We need three stone and one wooden wall lantern. And this is fully completed. That's insane. Three stone we ran out of. Wow. But yeah, guys, if you did enjoy this, don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe. All of us down below. And I'll see you in the next one. Thank you so much for tuning in. Peace.